I'd read some things and I was like, oh my God, that did happen, man. That was crazy, huh? I guess I did almost die, but that's okay. I went to go over this travel journal that I've kept um, in just about every country I've been to so far. I've only been to four countries and three of the four countries I have kept logged in this um, in this. <laughs> travel journal I can guarantee you it was less than five dollars because I doubt I'd pay less than five dollars for a journal um in the beginning says a journey of a thousand miles must begin with a single step boom knowledge so let's begin so I think that everyone should keep a travel journal because I was looking over this about two days ago and this is old like this is like three four years old the stuff I have in here and it's just really interesting to go back and remember everything that you've done things that you saw I'd read some things and I was like oh my god that did happen man that was crazy huh I guess I did almost die but that's okay that's brazy so I didn't really know what I was doing with this journal when I first made it but I kind of like what it became I would keep receipts and tickets of everywhere that I went because I wanted to remember it and like I said this journal is old so some of the receipts are like so worn I, I can't really make them out but others I can so it's just like um so this is like the first ticket I got when we got to London from I can't see from like Heathrow to Paddington so I just kept that and I like glue it in there and it, like receipts yeah I kept receipts okay like a hoardings in my blood I kept the receipts okay and then the eye of London like just like a lot of writing and I'm I'm not a diary keeper like I don't keep a diary on on the regular basis Whoa. more entries more tickets this is my I think this is a bus ticket yep from Par from London to Paris this was my this was my train ticket this is fun like I should actually go back and read all this stuff and then I have more tickets nope they're not tickets they're receipts I'm gonna be honest they're receipts I have a whole list of foods that I ate in Europe in no this wasn't in one day it was between London and France so it's like a whole list of foods that I ate because I wanted to remember the foods that I ate because I love food and that's just that's just the way it is um this was my luggage ticket I I don't know why I kept half of this stuff I really don't and then this was my I think this is my boarding ticket more receipts more writing these pages feel weird a little drawing of some fishies because I wrote a little short story and it involved little fishies so I drew some fishies like look at this this has been in here for so long you can't even read this like there's nothing there at all all oh, these pages are stuck together it's fine this was literally all just from a pamphlet that I had <coughs> I literally took a business card from this cafe because I went back so many times. It was in London and it was freaking delicious. Why is my voice doing this? <sighs> okay, so if you're ever in London, you should go to Cafe Bella Maria. I'm not kidding when I say like this was a journal diary slash scrapbook for me. And I don't know, I just love looking back at it. Like it just gives me, gives me so many feels of just like a happier time. Um, like I, I put a lot of like little short stories in here and, doo -doo -doo. and then now I'm gonna skip over this okay so then we get into Bolivia when I went to Bolivia this is gonna be a two-part video because I, I, I'm i already at 16 minutes and there's no way in hell that I would sit down and watch a 16 minute video because I don't do that mm -mm. 